Power 96.1. It's Atlanta's number one hit music station. I'm Moran, and I am in a great mood because I am surrounded by just pure talent, raw, just good talent. Two members of the lovely band, Little Dragon. I'm going to let y'all introduce yourselves to the people just in case they don't know who y'all are. Hey, everyone. I'm Yukimi. I'm Hokan. It is a pleasure to meet y'all, see y'all. Welcome back to the city of Atlanta. Y'all Thank definitely you. have a lot of love and a lot of fans out here. So this has been a great progression for y'all musically. How do y'all take in all of y'all success up to this point? Um, well, I mean, I guess we feel it. At like We had a show last night, and mm. there was so much love from the audience. It and was, was a, cooking. Yeah, it was Boiling. overwhelming. So we just yeah. try to like enjoy it, take right. it all in. Take it all in one step at a time? Mm, pretty much, yeah. That's really good. That's really good. So I just want to say, this is kind of random, but High came out the day before Valentine's Day. So I heard it on Valentine's Day. This year, Valentine's Day just so happened to fall on a Tuesday. So I literally had Little Dragon and Taco Tuesday. <laughs> I just want to tell y'all personally, thank y'all for that. <laughs> <laughs> I really appreciate y'all. So being a woman in this industry, do you find certain obstacles to be harder for you seeing how you are a woman in a group with a bunch of males? How do you take in, you know, the fact that you, cause you really do have a main role, not that you're just a singer, but you're also a woman and you're dope. Mm. Um, I think it's uh, I take it pretty well. I, I mm. haven't felt any specific like obstacles. The guys are just, you know, we're just equals and, and mm. uh, um, even in the band, you know, we make every, all the decisions together. And, right. Uh, yeah, we have a mutual respect for each other as, as uh, That's and, yeah. 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 Yeah, just a year friends. So how long have y'all known each other? It's like 15, 20 years. Yeah, 15, 20 years? Yeah. So like, I don't know, like, do y'all, when it comes to maybe giving advice, is it sometimes hard to give out? Like, let's say, you should probably do this differently. Do you get annoyed sometimes? Oh, or because we're friends? <laughs> uh -huh. Yeah, I mean, sometimes, you know, when you have history together, you can... Mm. You know, it's like when you're family, you know, right. you don't yeah. always want to take your advice from your big brother or your sister, whatever. So, mm. uh, but, but I think we evolve, we're evolving together. We get better at communicating and all that. Yeah, <laughs> that's, I, I, yeah. that's dope. And I, I think evolution is a really good term to really throw at y'all, especially y'all sound, because when I listen to your music, clearly y'all stick to the script, but it's never the same. Like oh, it's that. it's like how how do you take an approach where how, like how do you do something different but still stick to your own roots without selling out? It's mm. a good question. It's a good question. Do y'all even realize that y'all do it? I mean, we try. You know, <laughs> mm. so it's good to hear it from you, for example. But yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, yeah, I think I think one of the tricks is you know staying out of your comfort zone. Mm. You know, uh, when you're creating, trying new stuff. Um, sometimes it feels good to just create and not think about that and do yeah, what you yeah. always do but, that's real um, so what is your creative process like do y'all just approach it like i just say you know what we're just gonna throw things at the wall and let it stick or is there like a real like syllabi format like okay we're gonna record this day that day oh, etc no. oh it's very loose yeah it's i mean we have to big. we go to the studio and then everyone's doing stuff and uh, sometimes good stuff <laughs> comes out and then you came in Go and listen to it, maybe take it home and write maybe some lyrics. And right. after that process, we can kind of schedule in the <laughs> or like, can we record today? Yeah. No, we try to. It's pretty, I mean, it's both nice and sometimes uh, frustrating, frustrating yeah. when it's mm. so big and open, you know, it's yeah. so free. I mean, we like it, but sometimes, you know, you got you to gotta force yourself to like, okay, let's finish this song now. <laughs> Understood. So what are some things as far as, because you said frustrating, and there are a lot of artists who are up and coming that look up to y'all. So what is some advice that y'all would give to up and coming artists when they come across something musically that can be frustrating? Um, musically? Or I mean, maybe maybe creatively. Maybe, yeah, I think creatively uh, would be the I best think way. Give, give it some time because that's mm. something that's been helpful for us, I think. You yeah, know, like yeah, 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 yeah. one day you love the song and then maybe the next week you hate it. Right. And sometimes you don't even vibe with the song the first moment and then, you know, maybe two years later you'll find it and, and want to, you know, you're like, I don't know, this, this idea has something. You know, it has right. a vibe, mm. so... So, I mean, you don't, I wouldn't recommend to wait two years, but, <laughs> but not, not be too caught up with your feelings, I guess, sometimes with the, I mean, enjoy the moment if it's good, but, but mm. if it's not the best in the world, don't be hard on yourself, I guess.
Yeah, and that's dope. an advice we try to give ourselves as Pretty well. Pretty much, yeah. Wow. So y'all stick to your own script. Yeah. Practice, <laughs> practice, <laughs> practice what y'all preach. So good question and a hard, hard one. That's yeah. dope. Yes, that's really good. So the album, Season High. What have been some season highs for y'all this year? You know, it's the summertime. Right. What have I been mean, some highs? Finishing the album was definitely a high for us. Mm -hmm. yeah, 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 yeah. Because yeah. definitely. Sometimes I sometimes we feel like it could go on and on and on forever if if it was you know up to us. But um, I mean, playing live on this tour has been. Mm -hmm. There've been some definitely some very special moments. Really? Any crazy groupy stories? I mean, no, just, I think just yeah. groupy stories. Uh -huh. I mean, just connections, yeah, you know, yeah, yeah. with mm. the crowd. Like those moments where you just really feel like you are there together. You know, it's it's a, it's like a, a vibe. And, and I think that's that's yeah. something that's kind of, you know, it's almost hard to describe. It just feels good. Yeah. That's good. It never gets too crazy with our fans. Yeah, somehow. we got pretty cool, respectful friends. Yeah. Yeah, that's, <laughs> that's really cool. Well. We can definitely leave it there on that note. But before we run out of here, y'all have any, um, when I give y'all social media out there, Twitter, Instagram, just in case there are some people who are not awoke or are not aware of Little Dragon. Sure. Yeah, our Instagram is uh, Little Dragon Flicks. Check it out. Um, we're on Twitter and uh, Facebook and all that stuff. Yeah, yes. Little Dragon. They're not hard to find. No, go ahead. YouTube. YouTube. Yeah. Yes. Okay. Definitely get on YouTube. Watch their videos. <laughs> They'll help you get through your work or whatever you got going on if you need to focus. Oh, perfect music to exercise to. Perfect, yes. Oh, okay, perfect. Cool. Just had to throw that out there so you know. What's nice. your favorite kind of I would to have exercise. to say probably pretty good. No, come home. Come home. Oh, wow. Come home. I mean, come home. Yeah. Yes. Yes. <laughs> yes. What's, it's what's your exercise like? Like <laughs> let, no, like no, cause like come home, I will say this. It, it's just a certain vibe that comes yeah, yeah. with it. Like I don't know, your voice is just like, come on. Like, if you're running, you're running a mile, come home. Oh, Finish. Okay. Wow. Come home. Yeah, like, nice. you on your way. You about to run out. Hero. Yes, <laughs> yes. So, yeah, definitely. If That's I had to. That's cool to hear. Yeah. yeah nice. So, yeah. Got some aerobic info out there, some advice for artists. It's pretty cool. Shout out to Little Dragon. I'm a random man. Little Dragon. Power 961. It's a wrap.